welcome to Anime Figure Focus, the channel where we talk about our anime figure collection. My name's Eric. And I'm Amanda. Today we're reviewing Saber Triumphant Excalibur Edition uh, by Good Smile. Yeah, it looks like it. Um, hmm. And uh, obviously we have the OG Saber here, but before we talk about her, let's talk about the box. As always. Yes. As always, we start with the box that it came in. Excalibur! So check it out. Um, that's from the game. Anyway, um, <laughs> box. It's pretty reflective, isn't it? Ooh, God. Lord. Hello. Blind me out. Oh, my eyes. With all the lights in here. Good Lord, it's dusty. I just noticed. Well, wow. yeah. she's. <laughs> it's been sitting up in that. little dust. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's, yeah. Ooh, it's getting dust Lord. everywhere. Check it out. Jeez. It's a box. It's got uh, pictures of Saber on it. Okay. That one's kind of a crappy picture, isn't it? I just, I think the box is ugly in general. <laughs> I'm gonna be Guys, honest. Guys, it's a pretty ugly box, I'm not gonna lie to you. I mean, <laughs> it's not it's nice. Not, it's, <laughs> it's, I it's mean, okay, okay guys. it protects it. I mean, that's the it's got, most important part, right? You know, it's got a window, it's got a window, <laughs> it's got a window and a window, so. I mean, it's just cool. It's just an anime figure box, guys. With that's really shiny. There's more stuff in there. No, there's just no. I thought I heard garbage stuff jiggling around. Nothing in there, in there but uh, Jingle, anyway, jangling. It's just a box, guys, and it's not very great. It's pretty looking to me, but that's all subjective. Moving on. Moving on. <laughs> what, what you know? To... What else is subjective? <laughs> 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 yeah, anime figures. So check it out. Anime figures. Uh, guys, this is Saber, um, the OG from, you know, Fate Stay Night. And I'm trying to look up her actual name. It's like... <sighs> oh, Jesus. One second. Alturia. Oh, uh, Alter Arturia. She's technically Prince Arthur, but female. Huh? Alturia. Yes, yes. Fate. That is fate for you. Um... So check it out, guys. Um, I had to get her because, like, a little background. I have played the Fate uh, Stay Night visual novel. Uh, it was a fan translation, obviously, um, because I don't think it was av made available. Like, I don't even to this day. I don't even think it's made available. Like, uh, I don't know. Other than fan <laughs> translation, but uh, yeah. So I actually uh, ended up playing it because everyone was like. Fate's one of those franchises you hear about, but you don't know how to get into. So I was just like, okay, let me just start from the beginning and get where it was like kind of, I guess it began, which is the visual novel. And let me just get that experience. I played through two playthroughs. I didn't do the Heaven's Feel playthrough, but anyway, not to get into all that, I wanted to get this figure because it's like the OG look of Saber, of uh, Alteria. So I know nothing about any of this. <laughs> I well, don't. I, I've never. That's not a problem. I've never played it. I've never. She's reviewing it like we do most of our figures. Like a lot of our figures, we don't really know the the history of the figure. We just like the right. figures. Uh, she's only saying that because she doesn't like fate. She I, doesn't like saber. I don't like the figures at all. She doesn't. Like, she's I not big on any like them. fate. I'm probably gonna trigger stuff. so many people, and I'm very sorry. Yeah, it's pretty just, much sacrilege for an anime figure collector to not uh, have a saber or like saber or I'm any sorry. of the fate I figures. I mean, okay. Um, I like the other saber up there. Yeah, that's but, the bride. Yeah, bride version. Yes. I just. If I were to pick and choose, I would not go well, this route. <laughs> to be fair, she's not fan. She's not a fan of like the armor and stuff. I like medieval fantasy, right. and so I was always a big fan of the the outfit. I, I I really like it. I like the whole King Arthur thing. I mean, I, I like medieval stuff, but like as far as collection and a figure, like I'm not. Yeah, she doesn't like just, armor. She likes clothes, like frilly clothes, frilly, girly, girly. <laughs> and Saber's not really frilly right. girly. She's kind of like a badass. So well, hey. Um, so here's Whatever. the thing. Let's talk about. We will talk about the armor. So yeah, she's got her typical armor panels, kind of that go down, mm -hmm. uh, I guess, along her like waist and legs, and then she's got the uh, her Gauntlet. breastplate, gauntlets, mm -hmm. um, and. For the most part, I think it's shaded decently. You have yeah. a nice metallic uh, kind of gunmetal gray look mm -hmm. uh, along, I'd say, all of it. Um, my favorite metal bits are these bottom bits because they have like a really neat kind of uh, like look to them. Like shape to them. Yeah, they're cool. Shape, but the, just the paint job. I like how they're, the metallic look uh, on yeah. them is. I feel like she is really true to the character. Even her armor, her outfit, uh, her face even, I think is very true to character. Her sword, Excalibur, mm -hmm. uh, true to character. Uh, 
And uh, I do want to talk, let's just talk about the blues, because I know that's something... Yeah, that was a kind of a gripe that I had. I mean, I think in general, like, the back part and, like, the top is okay. Mm -hmm. The paint on it is fine. I mean, yeah, yeah the lines might not be very straight, but, I mean, t I'm not going to gripe on that, because I can it's only not imagine bad. having to... Yeah, Painted you're talking all, about the right? gold. Right. Right. But I'd say like this, what is this? A, um, what do you call this? Like a, It's almost like a tabard. Like but a tabard kind of thing. Yeah. Um, the paint on this is kind of, eh. You know what though? I won't criticize the figure for that. I don't know if it's my fault. Well, I don't. And, and, and I bought it pre-owned, so I don't know if that's yeah, the problem that's either. True. So I don't want to criticize that because it might be true. something that the previous owner don okay. did, or maybe it was something that Maybe it is a manufacturing defect, or maybe it's just dirty and I didn't yeah, wipe it. Yeah, maybe, but it, it uh, does almost seem like this, like a... Like the, like the um... Like the uh, shading, like they were trying to put a wash yeah, on the it darker or something. Shade. It just kind of like yeah. dried kind of funny, but... It doesn't look the best right here in the front, but I think that the back blue looks really, oh, really looks good. Great. Yeah. The you have like is... a really nice deep tone there. Mm -hmm. You have like light and dark blues, and I think it looks really good with its... Um, I guess it's kind of flowing in the the wind or whatever, or she's jumping. So I guess it's right. flowing with <laughs> yeah. the wind as she's jumping. But it, I think it looks really good. And even like the top parts of her outfit with the arms, I think that looks pretty cool too. Uh, it's just true to character, and I think that that's probably the biggest, mm -hmm. uh, you know, thumb up I can give it. Yeah, and I know before this, like. I, I made sure that I looked at pictures beforehand because, like, I have yeah. no clue. <laughs> but yeah, she looks yeah. really good compared to exactly her and likeness. So I, I I like the um I like the white bit. That's I don't cool. know what this is like a, a part of her dress or yeah. whatever. I like the little golden pieces. Little details on it. Yeah. Yeah, and, and, the, the, and the actual cutout. <laughs> the cutout. Yeah. Yeah. So it, it just looks really good. Um, it's kind of hard to see, but it, you know, yeah. underneath it's kind of so-so, but. Yeah. It's, um, it's not like they, they didn't really do anything under there. No, it? it's just kind of, you know, flat or whatever. Right. But I mean, you can see how they kind of, it looks like they tried to do some shading in the, uh, oh, the yeah, ripples. Oh yeah, it's kind of like, yep. Because you can see that along there too, which is kind of nice. And then, you know, the sculpt is just, you know, it's good. It's good enough. Yeah. Um, Amanda, uh, let's just talk about the head real quick, uh, starting with the face. I mean, as I said, when we were, you know, we looked at pictures beforehand, her face does look really good Yeah, the, compared to how she's supposed to look. Yeah, so it's I very, don't really... I think it's true to character. And um, I mean, the paint, I mean, the, you know, the eyes look great. Yeah. You know, it's clear. It's, you know... You know what I just realized? Hmm. She has teeth, but not just like top teeth. She has bottom teeth. Oh, yeah. I mean, that? it looks great. Too. That's weird. I mean, she's kind of yelling, like she's kind of yeah. like, I'm, I'm attacking. But so, you don't yeah. normally see like an open mouth with bottom yeah. teeth. And not in our <laughs> figures, like maybe it's a thing for like attacking, but like maybe most of our figures aren't attacking. Most of them are like posing. I mean, they might be attacking in other ways, but uh, maybe <laughs> not with a sword. <laughs> yes, but she's definitely engaged in some combat. So. <laughs> Uh, speaking of combat, let's talk about the. Oh yeah, let's let's finish up on the head. Yeah. The hair. What do you think of the hair? It's okay. Yeah, it's not it's the. It's alright. The shading isn't as good as it could be. Mm -hmm. I think. Uh, the blonde doesn't have a lot of depth to it, but I mean yeah. it's fine. It's shaped like saber hair, so I can't hate on it. Right. But it, there's probably better out there. Yeah, I, I'm sure there's better molds. Yeah. For it, I mean it, it's good for what it is i guess yeah exactly but. it's fine it's it's saber so um it looks it's fine yeah um but moving on to the swords so it actually comes with two uh you have that uh, excalibur uh i guess non-invisible and then you have the actual invisible mm -hmm. form uh which i guess technically invisible would me would be me taking it off <laughs> Jeez. She's right. like that's, can't see anything. Technically that's how it is. Like even if you watch like the vid like there's um anime versions, mm -hmm. like she's just looks like she's doing this and you're like, oh my God. Yeah. What is going on? The only on? time it does this is when she's using her like whatever <laughs> like a, phantasm. Freaking power yeah. up. <laughs> yeah, her special move where she goes Psh, Excalibur and then chops, chops, yeah. And then it goes all beam and stuff. Anyway, so I'm yeah. sure that was Perfect. It was spot on. <laughs> spot on. So yeah, pretty cool that you can choose it's which one cool. you want. I mean, this one's clearly. I mean, why wouldn't you use I this mean, one? Right. I, I cool. keep this one on the base because you know, just keep it here. I do like um, this um, energy. Energy. 
<laughs> like, what do you the call wind? that? <laughs> um, the power? It looks cool, yeah. Magic? I don't Although, know. Although, yeah, like, we've said multiple times yeah. for, like, stuff that's, like, translucent or, yeah. like... It's it probably can it dirty. can get dirty really easy. Like this dust still on it, and we just dusted it. Yeah. Like it's crazy. Well, we probably need to actually do a hard clean. Yeah. But you know, because like for a long time, <laughs> it like attracts to it like crazy. She oh was my God. displayed out of glass uh, <clears throat> At display one point, for yeah. a long time, so that's probably why she got a little bit dirty. But anyway, the base. Really? I, there's a lot of fate figures that have this exact same base, and I like the base. Uh, it's cool. It holds her up really well. You have this really nice metal <clears throat> peg that keeps her pretty well stable. Like, check this out. Like, I mean, she's wobbling, but that's just how it is. But yeah. she's on there, like, she's not gonna fall over. She feels solid. Yeah. Um, so I think that that's really good. And then I, I like the little details in the base. It's not just a flat base. Yeah. It, it's like some action happened on it. You have like- So I wish this cobblestone, well, not really cobble, I don't know. Uh, but this- Tile? I, tile, I wish it- yeah. I wish it was a little bit more like good textured, I guess. And it not could so be like better. flat and then they were like, Oh, let's just do like a little cut out here to make it look like it's it, <laughs> it does look a little plasticky. <laughs> like I've definitely done better like Warhammer forty K bases and stuff. Uh just DIY. Mm -hmm. So yeah. it could have been better, but it's not bad. It's I, not bad. I think it's cool for what it is. Yeah, it's cool. You know, so yeah, I think that's a, a a good thing rather than like a just bad a thing. flat like yeah, base it's still good. I mean, it could be cool. better. Yeah, but it's still good. What do you think about the actual? Uh, I guess these are greaves. Uh, they're like they're the dope. boots. They're cool. Yeah, I like them a lot actually. Yeah, they're actually pretty cool. They're really cool. I I love the whole like um, I don't know really contours. I don't know how how do you get those on, dude? Like they're not even like they're not even like. I guess you could slide that up, right? I mean, I don't I've, know. I've watched some videos like medieval, like yeah. now. Th I think this is one dude pieces, I watch on right? YouTube that like he's yeah. like he's really into that stuff. I don't yeah. remember his channel name, but you know, yeah. can't shout out to that dude. But is that a possibility? <laughs> it looks like you yeah. could slide into it, but um, I don't know. I would. It seems like he, there's not a whole lot of. Uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna actually like criticize the armor too much guys this is just like it's just something <laughs> just, that popped in my head we're just talking guys <laughs> it's just it's just it's cool it's cool it's cool that's all you need to know it's cool so yeah uh i guess um to summarize the figure it's it's saber as you know her from the visual novels it's saber as you know her classic uh she looks great she's in a very awesome pose that's jumping it's dynamic it's it's very i don't know it's everything i love about saber the character in an anime form, like anime figure form. So I think that it's perfect. I was really happy to pick it up. It's not my favorite figure, but it is an awesome figure. Yeah, I mean, if you're really into fate. If you like fate, if you like Saber, definitely pick this one up. I, You're not gonna regret it. All right, guys, this has been Anime Figure Focus. Like this video if you liked it and subscribe if you wanna see more videos like this one and leave a comment down below. Uh, have you watched or participated in any of the Fate Stay Night or Fate Grand Order? Have you done any Fate stuff? Uh, do you like Fate? Comment below, let us know, and we'll see you guys in the next video.